Hey guys, Trench from Rainbow here. Gonna be talking about this Taka Plupa mask. So stay tuned for this awesome review on where you can get your hands on an exclusive mask just like this one. Hey guys, it's Trench. I'm here to talk about the Taka Plupa mask. Now I know a lot of you guys have been waiting for this review because you guys have been looking at our Facebook page and cool for you because you guys are awesome always checking out our Facebook page for updates and stuff like that so go ahead and like our Facebook page I'll put it right here so anyway let's talk about this mask now you guys are going to notice a few things that are different from the mask that we used and this mask itself now we did use the um, quote unquote cactus hobbies mask I say this because cactus hobbies ripped off uh, the creator of the actual mask and that's why we don't do business with them anymore but that's a whole nother controversial story so let's get into this Taco Pupa they are uh, Marino and his brothers they they created these masks are the actual original creators of this mask so every knockoff that you see on the market today um, is based off of their des actual design so they got uh, they got the rights to use the uh, the army of two masks and everything like that and uh... this is what you see so this is a hybrid version of that um, the reason we we made him make a new mask is because uh... we had some issues um, with the actual vision of the eyes the mesh in the eyes was was uh... as you could tell if you own the 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 masks those gen one masks gen two masks that they have uh... or the gen one masks that they have the mesh is a little bit thinner it's more looks like this than this and you can completely tell that there is a massive difference in the two. So uh, what's cool about this mask, um, it covers the ears. So you got some mesh right here so you can hear a little bit easier. Comes out a little bit more. Uh, covers the, the side of the face a little bit better. The mesh, you can completely see through it. The mesh in the front, so it's better for breathability because we've had some issues with the breathability on that. And also you're going to notice uh, the straps. The reason they changed out the straps on here, and, and, and mind you, this is a prototype. This is only a prototype, so we're working with them right now to actually make this mask better than it already is. So um, right now, uh, we're, we're talking to him about the straps. So um, these straps he made, uh, these are nylon, really strong. They're non-elastic. I know a lot of people were talking about, including myself, um, uh, the elastic is starting to, uh, you know, fade out a little bit, kind of stretchy, 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 and then it stops getting stretchy. Well, these are, um, these are more, uh, I would say robust and for longevity reasons, this is going to be, um, this is going to actually work out a lot better than the, than the actual stretchy stuff. So this is Taco Plupa's, uh, you know, symbol right here. This is their new symbol. Cactus Hobbies is a no-go. We don't use them anymore, so I advise you to check out Taco Plupa uh, because their masks are... Um, and I'm not just saying this because they hooked us up with the mask, but I'm saying it because uh, I stand by I stand by this mask because they're built with quality. Unlike a lot of other masks out there, you'll notice they fall apart fast or whatever. You'd even notice the padding in here. Um, you just take off this, which is cool, by the way, just like the old mask, the... Uh, we got the snaps, but um, you'll you're gonna notice a, a magnificent amount of padding in this thing. Um, goes all the way up at the top of the forehead area, um, the sides, all the way around the ear lobes. You know this thing is on point. Right here, you're gonna notice these two little tabs. Well, this is for a lens to pop in. I have the lens um, over here. I was playing with it earlier, but I have the lens. That's gonna be something that we're gonna change because this is the prototype. So I'm I'm thinking more of a uh, well I'm not gonna talk about it now because I don't want to just blow my load everywhere. So we're just gonna we're just gonna stick with this. Um, this is for lens. So a lot of fields don't allow um, don't allow uh, just just mesh because of the possibility of a BB coming through or whatever. So uh, Taco Plupa really thought this through with us. We talked to him. We've been talking for a long time about making um, mesh with the uh, with an actual lens inside. So, uh, and it's going to be interchangeable, so in case you go to a field that allows mesh, you don't have to have the, uh, the glass inside. So we could also have um, dark lenses, light lenses, and uh, yellow lenses for whatever your specific needs and wants are. So that's an amazing uh, thing. 
Uh, these guys are amazing artists. They hooked me up with this awesome, uh, this awesome mask. I told them what I wanted. Uh, I got an, I got this idea off a mask I saw, and uh, you know the all-seeing eye and the demons, the demon's face. Really cool, um, really cool mask. Really, really comfortable uh, so far. Um, so just some minor changes in the mask, but in uh, in in general, this mask is uh, is on par. I mean, uh, it's comfortable. It's it feels about the same uh, weight. So uh, these masks will be available to you guys soon, um, as soon as we finish with Marino and his bros uh, on it, on creating the mask to specifics um, to make it better, uh, to make it more comfortable and make it more efficient to use for you guys as well as us. Um, so we'll be coming out with that information uh, very soon and so uh, hopefully you guys could purchase these masks and uh, we'll have more details on that. But in the meantime, um, in the meantime you guys could just look at these masks I guess. Um, we're going to have these uh, pictures of these masks on our Facebook page. We already have some on our Facebook pages of these masks. Um, Golk and Vandal already received theirs. This one is mine. Um, also, uh, we have uh, Chaplains and um, Caspers coming in, and uh, they're actually has they have the upgraded mask, which has better padding than this one, which is unbelievable to me because the padding already is high quality and sewn really well, and there's already a lot of it. So I'm I'm kind of excited to see what the uh, upgraded padding is going to be on this particular style mask. So uh, thanks for watching, guys. If you have any questions, please blast comments about the, the mask, questions about the mask. Um, and uh, so this is it. Um, this is uh, the new mask. Check out Takaplupa at their, at their Facebook page. If you type in Takaplupa, it's T-A-K-A-P-L-U-P-A, -A -A, I believe so. Takaplupa. It's kind of how it sounds. Anyway, I'll put a link right here for the Facebook page or actually underneath um, in the, in the uh, description. And uh, go ahead, check them out. Message them. Ask them questions. They're, they're willing to, to uh, work with the, with the uh, consumer about uh, something new, something different. So go ahead and shout them out and uh, hook them up. Uh, they're an awesome company. And they... Uh, I believe they're the future of, of airsoft masking in the in the United States, honestly. So, um, stop buying for Cactus Hobbies. Stop buying from all these other knockoffs. These guys are the real deal. These guys are the guys who made this. I mean, this is hand-painted. I mean, get out of here, right? This is hand-painted. This isn't stencil or anything like that. This is a legitimate hand painting so these guys are for real and they don't play around with their with their masks they really put a lot of attention to detail into them and that's the type of quality that i would expect uh out of any type of product that i buy is attention to detail and quality products so um i'll put i'll let you guys know a little bit in the future about um how they perform i put it on i ran around with it no issues no no like shaking it's not heavy it, it feels about the same if not a little bit better than the uh, than the other ones. Well, a lot better because of the padding. So um, just uh, stay tuned for, for more updates on this mask. And uh, make sure you check out our Facebook page because we're going to be doing contests and stuff. And we're probably giving away one of these masks. So uh, stay tuned to uh, our next videos. And uh, I'll be seeing you later. Trench out.